This is one of our bi-weekly uh, meetings of the Tone Army. Corey. Scott. Gabe. Uh, one of the cool things about the Tone Army, one thing we tell potential inductees, is that not only are we accredited, we're the only accredited uh, vinyl association, or uh, I mean, uh, vinyl club in Southeast Idaho. Uh, we're accredited not only by the AVA, the American Vinyl Association, the NVA, the, which is the National Vinyl Association, and you've probably heard of the INVA, the International Vinyl mm -hmm. Association, uh, but what we consider our, our pièce de résistance, I think we would say, is that we're accredited by the Humaway. Yeah, and so no one else, we're about 70% positive that no one else in Idaho, let alone Southeast Idaho, can say that. Right. So. Well, I'm 80%, <laughs> but... Really? Okay. Yeah. I've had a strong desire to be, I think we all have, uh, to be a Humaway. Um, Ever since, I mean, for me, ever since I heard Elton John um, just pounding those keys at a, at a play group. Mm -hmm. Right. I'm sorry. Remember that, guys? I'm sorry, Homo A? Homo A, yeah. Homo A. It's the Hi Fi Organization Music of America. Uh, play group? Uh huh. Yep. Play group, a bunch of dudes just kind of hook up, play some music, listen to music, together. T together, right. Yeah. yeah, together. And that's it? Yeah, yeah, just right. that's pretty much all that happens. We get to get, we gather together, a bunch of guys, and then um, we listen to music, exactly. Right? Yeah, mm -hmm. we play music, play group. Yeah. That's why it's called a play group. By play, I mean we like start the turntable. We don't like play the instruments or anything, but just, well. you know. Um, we were brought together by a mutual respect and appreciation of badminton, the sport. Um, we started as a duo, just Corey and me, um, but then decided that we might want to start um, something special, a trio league of uh, where there's like three people on each side of the court. So, I mean, it, you know, it started with badminton and then um, and then it obviously and naturally progressed to listening to records. Um, That's a good question. Well, uh, we, we start with just a quick listen, just to loosen up a little bit. Um, and then we follow that with uh, some discussion on the latest news. It's almost like a, a podcast, uh, but just without recording anything. You know, where we talk about like the... Yeah the events of the week uh, that are have a bearing on the vinyl right. world. Mm -hmm. There's, I guess you could say, a little bit of a disagreement. Um, in a more heated moment, someone in the Tone Army could have called it a cause for a major rift. But uh, yes, I'm not sure if we can expect them to show up tonight. Uh, um, I guess it stems from a, a conflict uh, a difference of opinion, if you will, about the rules, the the bylaws is what we have actually called them. Sure. Uh, mm -hmm. <clears throat> but uh, one that's really important to me is just that we stick to original presses of records. Okay. Some people think that doesn't matter at all, but um, basically I think it's important to have the same experience as someone going to the record store in 1970 and uh, picking up Space Oddity or something, you know, uh, to just get in that mindset during our our, our playtimes. What have you guys been up to the last while? Yeah, you know, just uh, listening to some vinyl, some uh, various artists, and really just like trying to find like the really good, you know, remastered. We picked up a uh, Abbey Road remastered yeah. uh, pressing that came out a few years ago. Um, you know, we've been playing that over and over. We you know, we, we don't really like David Bowie very much, so... He's a bisexual. Yeah. And by some people, did you specifically mean the other two members? One or two other people in the group. Okay. Yeah. Um, do you know by chance 
if uh, there's any way you guys will reform, reband? Well, I'd like to say, yeah, I would love to get over this, get through this. There's nothing in the world to me more important than the Tone Army. You know, I've worked literally months to get this group of guys together. Um, you know, so obviously if, if they could basically agree with me on this, I would be totally down. Um, hey, Corey. Yeah, hi, Scott. It, yeah, it's me. Yeah, yeah, doing good, doing good. Good, I'm, I'm just, uh, I'm just gonna put on uh, uh, an original mono pressing of Pet Sounds. Just listening to it the other day, I think you'd, I think you'd really dig it. Yeah, yeah, the, the OG press is definitely better than uh, these knockoff uh, represses, you know. Uh, it's definitely a, a different experience. Um, you, you would? Okay, um, yeah man, come on over. Throw it on, absolutely. Sounds good, Tom will be right over. Yeah, we'll be right over, we'll, we'll see you then. Okay. Final army. What, who, who was that for the camera? That was, that was, uh, it was Corey, the other member of, well, the other third of the, the Tone Army. So are you guys back together again? It's looking good. I mean, we're going to have to discuss things, but, you know, he's warming up to it. <laughs>